Nepp with a healthy lead at second. 2-1 to Colpeen. Hit towards center field. There's that big gaping area. It drops in. Nepp gets the wave around from third. The throw from center field. Nowhere close. And Caleb Colpeen walks it off in the bottom of the ninth. Three hours later. Plain fires the 0-1 in. Manning up the middle. Scoots on through. Caleb Colpeen gets the wave around from third. The throw not in time. And the Trojans for the second time today walk it off. One and two to Cowball from Mullins. Right up the middle, a missile from Ben Cowball. Getting the wave around his Colpe and then bobbling it as those Lori in center field. Taylor down six. They've matched the hit output of SAU at 10 apiece. Third one in the air to deep left field. Going back left and he stops and a humongous bat flip and rightfully so for the freshman Braden Manning. Two, two. Got him looking, strike three. Miller knew it right when it left his hand. Fourth one. Cowball turns on it to left field. Going back left and looks up, looks up. And this ball game is tied at 10. Ben Cowball hotter than fish grease. And we're all level at 10 in the bottom of the eighth as Cowball collects his fourth straight hit of the afternoon. The one, two to Bruin. Swing and a miss, and he's almost spun him around like a top. 2-2 Two -two again home. Hit towards center field. Picciotti races in. It's actually Cade Colpeen who dives and makes the catch in left field. Cougars lead the Trojans 2-0. They're dropping game one. And a flail and a spin. 360 for left. It got fooled every which way there from Holcomb. David at first. He goes, hit and run, hit towards the gap in left center field. It's going back, it's going back, it's at the bottom of the fence. David at full steam, rounds third. Cowball with his fifth, straight, make it his sixth. Straight hit, dating back to game number one. And the Trojans are to within a single tally.